Hi guys, today we are going to learn how to use TechPlot program to draw the curves or contours. Uh, number one is the curve. How to draw the curve using TechPlot? Okay, any curve. First, we have uh, to get uh, uh, data for first curve and second curve and so on. Uh, for example, if this uh, let me the, the uh, data for second curve and this is the data for the first curve we have to save this data as a dot dat mean means data okay uh, just take copy this data and then go to the notepad for example this notepad control v save and save as anywhere you would like um, px y plot dot d80 should be dot d80 and this be be for the first curve okay save go to the second curve this first and this second curve also make copy and then go to delete and then V again this for the second curve he just be second curve okay and then we have to start the tag cap load we have version 8 uh, go to the file load data file and then go to tag cap load data this is the source or directory this for the first scale open and then we can see the curve okay uh, here we have the we can give a name for the curve it will be data a okay for the this curve line you can change the the fitting for example, polynomial exponential. I think power uh, power fit is more fitting. Uh, line thickness, mm, line color. For example, blue. Okay, uh, path range shaded. Okay, and so on symbols. If you want to show symbols, or if no need, okay, it's okay. Close, and then if you don't like to show this the data. I mean date just go to the audit do not show the border okay that's all and then you can go to the axis edit the axis from the area you can show I mean for uh, border full border for the curves this in the area tab okay in the line if you want to change the uh, the line color for the axis, you can change for X and Y. Okay, and then title. If you want to change the title for the Y axis, let be data A and B. Any any title. And then this is the type of the font style of font A and B. You can can also change the size to be small, so big is more suitable. For example, it be four. Okay, and then the distance between the y axis and the title. You know, for example, six. Okay. Same with the x axis, it be length and it is measured by meter. Okay, if you see this is very close to the numbers, just increase the distance. Okay, also it can be right, left, center. This is the title label, I mean the numbers. You can change the 
I mean the format integer integer and then slide zero zero or for example float uh, I mean how many precision behind the decimal or exponential e or best float depend on the value you have okay also the size you can change the size the color green for example it's up to you so for the y green it's okay best float okay best float the tick how I mean the small ticks auto space or the for the I mean uh, measure tick uh, is uh, divided by 10 gra gradient if you want to take like 20 subject from 10 okay 10 30 50 or 15 for example okay like this or 10 starting from 10 okay also for the x axis if you see that it's very big like you can see i mean i think it's more i mean confident consistent on there grid if you want to show the grid you can show the grid in x and y direction but i think it's, uh, here now it's okay this is the range you change if you want to change the range of the curve uh, by showing the minimum maximum for both x and y axis you can change for example if you don't like to start from zero you want to start from minus 0 0.001 you can put here for the minimum and the for the maximum same for the y axis okay now i think it's okay uh, what we want to do we want to add a new plot just go to the file again load data file uh, it will ask you uh, replace database and reset plot style no replace database and retain plot style yes maybe add to current database no we want to add okay add another cave okay which one is xy plot 2 open then you have to double click here okay 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 and just double click here on the curve and then go to the create map this map number 2 because we have a let's be b uh, x axis is v2 and y is also v2 so it's v1 okay you can see the second curve when you click on the second curve and go to the line just change the style powerful and the thickness 0.4 Okay, let's be for example linear cannot. Yeah, maybe okay, just to distinguish between them. And then let's be for example solid black. Okay, now close. Uh, after that, uh, you add it to curves. Uh, you can add more curves on this figure by same way and then go to the uh, xy xy symbol or the uh, line define symbol so you should know data style style x is f uh, to set define x y care fit uh, x y legend you can show the legend here all right so you can see this the blue color is for a data 
solid black is for B data. Now it's ready. After that, you can go to edit and then copy layout to the clipboard and then you can add your figures here and then if you don't like to show this I mean frame let's go to the uh, XY XY legend do not show the the frame sorry not this one uh, plane, no box okay it's okay also the color you can make this color this the font size font color close go again to edit copy layout and then delete paste again now it's ready if you want to minimize for example uh, go to right click to keep the XY ratio and then you can see this can be used to plot XY plot